Hello, welcome again to Deutsche Baptist Church Online. Well, we've seen the sun shine in the last week or so, and it's been amazing to be able to get out and meet with friends. Last weekend was a bank holiday weekend, and we had various barbecues and various things that we were involved in. One of the things that I did do, though, was to go to a wedding, a very small wedding because we were limited to 30 people. But nevertheless, a very important and momentous day for the special couple. And as we came together to celebrate them getting married, and as family and friends came and shared stories of, of the happy couple, it struck me that life and the things that go on in life continue irrespective of what's happening with the pandemic. Things may appear very, very different. Even church on a Sunday morning is now very different because we have to sing outside, because we're limited with numbers, because when we go inside, we have to wear a mask. And yet, life continues. And as I look around me, uh, whilst it would be very easy to feel that desperation of not being able to all meet up in person, not having the normality that we had before. As I look around me, I see things going on, life still happening. I see friends saying hello and meeting up for coffee. I see people out for walks. I have time with my own family. There's jobs to do. There's things that happen in life that still have to happen despite the pandemic. And it struck me that however different these times are, as life continues, so too can our relationship with Christ. You see, the Bible tells us that God is with us always, that Christ is there for us no matter what we are going through. And I'm reminded of those words because so often it can be a struggle, it can be really difficult. And yet, in the happy times, the challenging time and the sad times, Christ is always with us and always there for us. So I just encourage you this week, whatever it is that you're up to this week, just remember that Christ is there for you, that God is available to you. I hope that maybe through some of the stuff we put on the website, for some of you that are able to come to church, and maybe others of you are discovering your own ways of connecting with God. Well, I trust and I pray that this week that that will continue. And as you encounter God in these very strange times, that that encounter and that depth and that relationship will grow and you'll discover more and more of who God is and who he can be for you. So bless you this week. We hope you enjoy what we've put on the website, James's talk, uh, the worship group, and we look forward to catching up again with you either online or in church in person. Drop us a line if you need anything at all this week, but thank you so much for tuning in.